Hello everyone! In this tutorial I will be showing you how to make this soft cup of bra, which is one of the many variations that are included in the Wild Nights pattern. The pattern can be purchased on my Etsy store and the link is down in the bio. So without further ado, let's begin! So you will again cut out your pattern as always in your size and you will use a mesh fabric or power mesh. I am using this pink mesh and you will cut out your pieces. Now you can double line or you can just single line like I did. Then you're going to align the center seams of the cups and overlock the center seams. Or you can use a zigzag stitch if you do not have an overlocker. Now I will be also cover stitching the center seam flat so it lays nicely flat. You don't have to do this again, it's optional. And then I will attach the bottom part of the cup to the top part. Again I will overlock and I will cover stitch the seam in place. Now, once we have our cups done, we will attach the back to the front, again matching wrong sides together and overlocking it. Then moving on, we will attach fold over elastic and first we will attach fold over elastic at the center of the free edge of the cups. So left and right both. Moving on, firstly you will attach elastic just where I'm showing at that inner part of the cup and then and then you also want to leave a few centimeters at the start and then when you'll be attaching the elastic you want to cut that remaining top tail at an angle so you can securely insert it into the fold over elastic when you'll be attaching elastic on the on the outer part of the cups moving to the back piece and then again coming out at the outer part of the of the cup Now all is left is just to attach fold over elastic at the bottom hem. And then you will attach your o-rings and you will secure them with pins. For the o-rings in the middle, you will just sew fold over elastic with a three-step zigzag stitch and cut approximately I would say two inch strips which is five centimeters and you can put as many o-rings as your heart desire i decided to go with eight to attach them i just used a straight stitch and i back stitched a lot so i went back and forth, back and forth at least two times or three. And when you'll be attaching the o-rings, you want to look out for where you're placing your stitches. Because if you're going to place them a bit too far like I did, then it's going to create this pool which is okay but not that nice. So I would suggest you will attach the o-rings to the very edge of the folder rail elastic to make it neat. And here is the final bra. I decided to make matching garter belt, tongs and choker for a complete set. The tongs can be also purchased on my Etsy store and the link to the patterns to both of them is in the description box. So I want to thank you for your attention, I hope you learned something and if you like this please comment, like and subscribe. 
I'm currently really working hard on making my channel grow because I thoroughly enjoy this. And I want to wish you a nice day, everyone. Thank you. Bye.